Most Americans know CVS Health, a stock that we rate at 10 out of 10. It's the largest drugstore chain in the US with more than 9,600 locations. CVS leapt into the broader healthcare space in December 2018, acquiring Aetna for nearly $70 billion. Since then, the company has added Signify Health to its portfolio in September 2022, expanding into managed, serviced organizations and home health. CVS recently announced plans to acquire Oak Street Health, a primary care provider which will provide vertical integration. The problem is Oak Street isn't profitable and CVS's long-term debt has ballooned. Interest expenses are expected to reach 17% of its operating cash flow this year. According to Trackstar, a proprietary sentiment indicator, financial pros searched for CVS more than they searched for rivals Walgreens Boot Alliance and United Health Group. It all boils down to this. Can CVS add value through acquisitions? CVS stock has fallen 25% from its 12-month high to trade at valuations that make it worth digging into. CVS is much more than a drug retailer. It's on its way to becoming a healthcare behemoth with three business segments. In CVS's latest report, management said it expected 2023 EPS to exceed the $8.69 earned in 2022, with single-digit growth anticipated across all segments. CVS's margins have been stable over time. There's plenty of cash and assets to set against its liabilities and long-term debt. It has solid cash flow and its current ratio is adequate. However, its quick ratio is concerning. A lot could go wrong with CVS's recent acquisitions, but we don't see a huge downside. At worst, it limps along at $10 billion in operating cash flow per annum, which pays off its debt in less than a decade. The upside potential could add another $2 billion a year to the bottom line. And in the best scenario, CVS turns into the largest integrated healthcare provider in the US with a model that dominates the marketplace. For these reasons, we rate the stock a great buy now.